My name is Susie Ashworth. I am a quantum transformation and embodiment coach, and I help women step into limitless living and divine self-expression, which in plain English means let go of the shit that's holding you back so you can get what you want really freaking quickly. I consciously was expanding my mindset to be able to be in the energy of not only receiving, but also keeping and being in overflow and being in abundance. And we are here now and I've never felt so abundant in that receiving. I genuinely believe that most people who are not operating in the space that they want to be operating in, who do not have the abundance that they desire, um, are not seeing the clients that they want to see, don't feel like amazing when you wake up every morning because you get to live your life for the day. It's because your vision for what you desire is not big enough. There's no judgment. It doesn't matter whether it is going to happen or not. But the start of making a quantum leap starts with you being able to have the vision. The first step is always having a vision. It has to start with the vision and you can amplify the power of your vision by being in community like this with people who also have big visions. I want you to play around with your vision without any judgment. Just start playing around with it. And this is what this space, honestly, is for, for you to start playing around in your vision. Normally you have to think bigger than the people that you are surrounding yourself with, which is why this the free space is so fucking powerful. The second reason that people are not making quantum leaps in their lives, and the second reason why some people find it difficult to even envisage a bigger vision is because they do not believe that they are worthy enough to receive the thing that they desire. And when I say worthy, it can also mean that they are, they don't feel that they're deserving enough, they don't feel that they're good enough, they don't think they have the resources internally or externally to get to where they want to be. So they shut it down. It's also, um, um, you know, why I ask the question and you've got to like, when I put a question in the group, I really, really encourage you, whether you know the answer, don't know the answer, are triggered by the question, please participate. My job as a coach is to help people see things differently. It's to help you see your blind spots. So if I post a question, even if it doesn't 100% resonate, I'm doing it for a reason and I'm doing it to support you in being able to create, this is the name of the group, quantum success in your life and business. So often um, when people say that they can't afford it, they're thinking from where they are now and they're thinking about the resources that they are accessing now. They're not thinking about where they're going to be tomorrow or the resources that they're going to be able to access once they are in, once they're working with you, once you're in service with them. And so, so many people, when you think about your dreams, you're thinking about yourself right here, right now, and the fact that maybe you've had this failure or that failure, or you've tried something before and it hasn't been a success, or you've seen other people try things before and it hasn't been a success. And so therefore, you stop yourself from dreaming bigger. You stop yourself from having that vision and therefore you can never make that leap. You don't actually believe that it's really possible. Like there is more doubt in your mind about your capabilities and whether the universe really does have your back than there is belief. Energetically, you have to switch that up so that you are in belief, you have decided that it's possible and that you are worthy and that you are deserving and that you are enough. You have to adopt a new identity before reality says that this is you. And that's what the vision piece is about. 
you stepping in to a new identity to create the reality that's already happening in your mind. The things that you need to do to create a quantum leap in your business, consistent daily actions in alignment with the vision. If you are not taking consistent daily action in alignment with your vision, it's because you do not believe that the result that you desire is possible. Like really, I want you to be really real with yourself because we are so freaking good at bullshitting ourselves about what we're actually doing and who we are actually being. Most people are not taking action in alignment with what they want to create. You are responsible for you. And when you do the work to connect with your greatness, you are fully supported in every step that you need and desire to take. And I don't like using the word need, but you get to take. You've got to have a big vision. And whether that big vision is for yourself or for the world, it doesn't matter. I believe that you always have to have that security for self in able for you to act like with full at full capacity for the world. Not everybody, but it's just what I have seen in my own experience. And that you are worthy and deserving of that vision. And then you have to take consistent daily action, energetically, physically, consciously, subconsciously, and practically towards that goal. So you are embodying the identity of somebody who already has the vision before it's in your lap. That is how you create miracles. But it's a joy and a pleasure. Thank you so much for being here. And I will see you next time. Mwah.